So today I've decided to do a video all about this Harvey, this clever little device and how it can be used. I've been called back today by my customer because he has recently had solar installed and wants this now integrated with the Zappi. Now because of this configuration we have the Zappi wired via a high tough 6mm EV Ultra cable which goes to the consumer unit at the back of the garage. I would normally use the Cat5 that's integrated with an EV Ultra cable to hardwire the CT to monitor the grid. In this circumstance I couldn't do that because there wasn't enough room within the consumer unit to install the CT. My next problem was that the meter is located nowhere near the consumer unit and this is why I've introduced the Harvey to this installation. This is the Harvey. It is a clever little device that you can pair up with your Zappi. If we take a look inside what we have here is three CT terminals which can be used for solar, battery storage and monitoring the grid. So as you can see on this Zappi, the clients aren't actually home, but you can see from the grid they are still using 0.3 kilowatts of energy. Now, if you see the little sun symbol, you can see no arrows flowing. This is because the CT clamp has not yet been installed. It's also a cloudy day, so we'll see what it picks up. There was quite a lot going on inside this meter box, as you can see. What we have here is the Harvey. We have this CT here. Now this CT is monitoring the grid and this CT here is the one that I've just installed for the solar. Now what you've got to remember with this CT is that arrow must be pointing in the other direction because it's showing the energy produced going back to the grid. Now, as you can see on the Zappi, we have the solar producing 0.2 kilowatts going into the house. The house is using 0.6 kilowatts in total and drawing 0.3 kilowatts from the grid. Now in a perfect world, I would like to hardwire all of my CTs, but as we know, that just simply isn't the case. 